the cowardly bat. Long ago, the birds and the beasts had a quarrel. The birds gathered at the owl's home in the forest. Let us make war on the beasts, said the owl. Yes, let us make war, replied the other birds. You shall be our captain. Then the owl led the way and they all followed. As they passed the tree where the bat was hanging, they said, Come with us. But the bat answered, Don't you see that I am a beast? Then some beasts walking beneath the tree said to him, Won't you come with us? The bat answered, Don't you see that I am a bird? However, the bat followed the beasts for a short distance. Then he hung himself up in a tall tree and watched the battle. When he thought that the birds were sure to win, he flew to join them. I have come to help you, he said. We don't want you, said the birds. You are a beast. Oh, no, I am a bird, replied the bat. Look at my wings. Later, when the beasts seemed to be gaining, he went to join them. I have come to help you, he said. What shall I do? Go away, said the beasts. We don't want your help. You are a bird. Oh, no, I am not a bird, replied the bat. Look at my feet and my sharp teeth. At last, the birds and the beasts made a peace treaty. They will not fight anymore. The bat went to the birds and said, I wish to be a friend with you. But the birds cried out with anger. Go away! You are not a bird. He then went to the beasts. Please, let me be your friend, he said. But the beasts shouted at him, Go away! You are not a beast! Ah, said the bat, I see that I must live alone. He that is neither bird nor beast has no friends. Since that day, the bat was hidden in dark places. He flies only at night when both birds and beasts are sleeping.